poppin' all stars. Welcome back to my channel. It's Dan She Jamaican, your biggest and brightest shining star. So in today's video, I'm gonna be talking about the water element. Alright, so if you're just now finding me and this is your first time seeing me, I hope you really like this video and I hope this video inspires you to subscribe to my channel, click the notification bell so you know exactly when I upload a new video that you may be interested in. Okay, so water element. Water element. Water is um, ruled by Cancer. Scorpio and Pisces okay um, also the fourth eighth and twelfth house now the water signs are people that are emotional um, people that are connected and in tune with um, other people's emotions and just how other people feel you know um, this allows them to be super psychic um, also allows them to be very introspective as well you know they're they're able to be in touch with their own feelings and emotions so in return that allows for them to be able to nurture others and care for others so water signs are people that are very caring I'm a cancer moon in the eighth house so um, water is one of my strongest elements I have three strong elements water fire and earth um, so yeah, I'm a person that I would say that I understand the emotional realm, you know, I understand all that stuff and it allows for me to be very creative and it allows for me to be very nurturing, even to you guys, nurturing to my channel, you know, just thinking about how I feel about things and just, just everything, you know, being a water element, you're the type of person that likes to help other people to grow. You know, you like to feed other people. It's like when you think of um, a plant and you think of how does a plant grow? It needs water. So water signs are people, or if you have a lot of planets in these houses, you would notice that you live in an area of life where you like to help people and you like to connect with people. When you think of water, you think about fluidity. You know, you think about taking the shape and form of any and anything you know even your circumstances and situations so these people could be very adaptable you know these people could be go the people that like to go with the flow you know people that understand um how to connect with people on a very deep level you know and this allows for them to be very great artists it allows for them to be very great cooks it allows for them to be people that other people can feel safe around you know feel like they can express their emotions to um another thing about water is that water is like i've, I've already stated that you're nurturing and we need water to survive you know as human beings we need emotional stability emotional comfort so that's why you know relationships or just things that in increase a lot of endorphins or let off a lot of endorphins in us can make us feel emotional you know it can make us feel um that element can just provide for something that you want to keep experiencing so we can't live without water so we can't live without feeling these emotions you know whether they're good or bad you know we all range from um we have a lot of percentage of um we have a huge percentage of our body mass is due to water so we are people that are emotional creatures especially women so i think that water element is a very important element and i think that you know water helps to create a lot of other things you know once you emotionally understand something and once you have an emotional standpoint on something it helps to um drive your passion you know it helps to invigorate passion and ideas and it helps your it helps your fire so i think that um water can help create and it can also help drown you know so water element people can be overly emotional or they could just drown too much into their own emotions you know sometimes um it's always good to create balance you know i mean you can learn that from the sign of libra but it's always good to create balance because too much water uh, could drown you and kill you you know too much diving too much into your feelings and emotions can drown you and and blind you you know so I think it's important to find balance and find that, you know, if you have um, earth in your chart that, or if you find that you have 
a little bit of water in your chart then you won't be as emotionally invested in a lot of things and I think emotional investment is very important because it helps to develop um, the things that we care about you know so once we care about something we we cherish it and we nurture it so I think that you know when you think about the fourth house you know you think about family you think about coming together you think about blood you think about unity and you know you think about the same blood is thicker than water and I think that just this fluidity of just even even sometimes that statement isn't true because sometimes water could could not be thicker than blood physically but that water is still there and you still need it and it still connects you so I think water is a connective element you know um and it's 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 expanding you know it's always going in and out and i think water is also a very chaotic element as well because there's like the tides you know it goes up and down and so that's why you would connect the moon and the water together you know so in order to understand if you're not that emotional or if you don't have a lot of water in your chart i think it's very important to look at your moon sign and to look at those houses that i mentioned that rules the water element because understanding those elements in your chart will give you a deeper understanding of the things that you're connected to and the things that you care about because water is an emotions is like carrying you know it's what you carry so i think water is um necessary for growth and I think your emotions and how you feel about things are also necessary for growth. And so, yeah, I, I love water. I have a lot of water in my chart. I understand it makes you very intuitive. You know, once you're a person that has a lot of water in your chart, you're able to um, see how other people feel about things. You're able to um, cater to other people's emotions because you are in tune with your own emotions, you know. And it just helps to nurture because that's what i said water helps to nurture and grow so yeah that's pretty much what i have for this placement um please make sure that you go ahead and comment down below to help to add more to the discussion if you have more to say about the water element let me know what you think about water let me know how it helps you to grow let's open up this discussion i think metaphysics is a very great topic to speak about and astrology helps us to uncover who we truly are so yeah please go ahead comment down below if this is your first time seeing me and you enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this i have plenty more videos so please go ahead and subscribe to the channel don't forget to click the notification bell so you know exactly when i drop a new video and i'll see you in another one Mwah. peace To the highest mountain I just, I just wanna be free Fly me out to the highest mountain I just, I just wanna be free Fly me out to the highest mountain I just, I just wanna be free out to the highest mountain I just, I just wanna be free Listen, switching on my floor a few times on this track You can never ever say your motherfuckers whack If I ever take a break, best believe I bring it back And don't worry about me unless you're in my shoes And even by then, you'll be so confused Cause the lights, they be shining, man, and shit's really blinding And I'm trying to pay attention, but I steady can't find it I huff and I puff and I bark and I growl I'm the baddest bitch, and then when you finna call All the Spanish niggas, they be hunkin' when I walk And if you pay attention, you can see I'm number one I hop on a plane and I fly to the Bronx you hop on a plane and the flight not take off Oh and them see me, I mean that them one Oh and them see you, the punts not come off Winding them wheels, so I'ma write another song Time and a place, I'ma give you what you want I should not tree, I need king and I'm on Oh and them ox, Jimmy, I come from I can't tell nobody my name, the bond where I'm from You can't fuck right if you don't know if she come 